Well, good morning, folks. Hey, the old fisherman back with you. We on Lake Monticello. We're gonna try to catch us some of these doggone catfish on the rocks. Starting off with minnows. Uh, we're gonna see if we can catch one. I haven't been here in a while. Luckily, ain't nobody here today, so they must not be biting much. But uh, we're gonna we're gonna give it a shot. I believe it's some out here somewhere. We got minnows right now, but I got worms, and we're gonna fish with both. I'm gonna throw it out there and, run, and reel it in slow and see if we can pick one up with the minnow first. I see some fish out in there. I don't know what they are. The catfish or, or what? It was a couple swimming by. We got to figure out what the best retrieve, what the best bait, and might want worms today. We got both. I see a few fish swimming around, but they might be bass. Might not be catfish. The last couple of times I come over here, I wasn't able to get in here. It was somebody always in here, and I don't like to pull up on people along this bank. I like to have it to myself if I'm gonna do a video. And we might not, hey, they might not bite. I don't know. All we can do is try. So far, ain't looking good. We're gonna have to put our cork on. Try to catch them like there goes one, there goes one, there goes one. He hit it, but didn't take it. He hit it, but he, he took the metal off. That's why he done. Yep. I'm missing a doggone jig. Somehow another that come undone. I ain't got but one jig. Oh Lord, I hear one hitting. I think what we need to do is put our cork on and our worms. That's what we need to do at this point. Cork and worms is what it's gonna take, y'all. See what happened. Actually, that's a little bit big worm. I mean, lead. Lead's a little bit bigger than I want. These worms are so doggone soft, but they love them. I got 
got really too small a hook on here. <clears throat> All right, let's get back up. It's time for them blues to come in here. Them blues are usually big. Get back up there and throw up there and see what happens to this cart. We can chunk that baby. You can see it real good out there. I got on light line though. I probably ought to have the other reel set up. It's got a bigger line. And we only got six liters, so we asked him for it. We got eight pound braid and six pound floral coil, but there he goes already. Already took it. Oh, it might be a catfish day today, folks. Look at that. Number one. Glad you could be with me on another episode. We catfishing on the rocks now with my old earthworms from the house. And you see it. Huh? You see it. I got to get a rag out. I ain't got my rag yet. But we got number one catfish for the day. It didn't take long either. And that's what, that's what you want. You see it? See that? We got a little drum to throw them in. We, we cooking with Greeks now. The old timey way. Catfishing with a cart. On Lake Monticello with my old Georgia Wigglers from the house. It's messy. That's what we're going to do today. Cart fishing. Lazy man, I call it. All right. Lazy man fishing. Big old cart where we can see it and we can sling it, let it cart. Throw it out there and let us sit. See how long it takes for it to disappear. Y'all should be able to see the cart today, hopefully. That first one that stay out there long, more he took it quick. They might be here today. Catches a bucket full of catfish. I'm not going to use but one rod right now. I didn't quite get that one where I want it to. It needs to be in a little bit closer to the bank. Let's throw it in a little bit closer. That's where it needs to be. We might catch catfish. We might catch shell crackers. No telling what we might catch. There he goes. Boy, that didn't take long, did it? Huh? Y'all see that? That's a good one. Hey, they out there today, folks. That's a good one. Oh, my. That's a good one. We're going to have us a ball here today. We better get our net ready. I can tell you that. Our catfish net. We're going to need it. we definitely going to need it. Look at here. Look at here. Look at here. They out there today, folks. Oh my, look at here, look at here. That joke is bending, ain't it? I'm using a uh, 11 foot Crappy Pro rod. It's a long rod, and we're fishing about eight foot deep, a 10 foot deep, eight to 10. And we got a nice channel cat, look at here, look at here, look at here. Folks, we're gonna have a good time here today. That joker, he pulled it to the bottom. Huh, that's a nice one. What? He took it down too, buddy. He took it down. We're gonna have to get our catfish poker. We got this poker we always use to poke them out. I need to get me a towel where I can wrap them. See that? Come right out. You see him? Beautiful cat. Loving life with the old fisherman. <clears throat> Might as well put these metals up. They in the way. All right. Let's put some another doggone worm on. Catch another doggone catfish. What y'all say?
These Georgia wigglers are hard to beat for catfish. It's something about them, they smell them, but and they'll take them. This catfish is nasty now. It's plum nasty, but it's fun. <clears throat> I think we're gonna have a good time, is what I think. Let's get back up there, y'all. To where the big girls lie. All we doing is we chunking that thing up there, close to that bank. I like to put it about eight foot of water, which is about that far off the bank. And them catfish run that bank and them rock ledges in there. And uh, what they do is they, they can scent that doggone worm. If they feed him, he won't stay there long. They run it up and down that bank feeding on whatever. And they'll run across it and the cart will go. And I got a pretty big cart, it's red, and I believe y'all can see it today, hopefully. If they biting, really one rod's all you can handle. If you put, I got another rod I can put out. I got the old uh, uh, ACC crappy stick with a cork on it, will work too. It's heavy, but it'll, it'll, you can really manhandle these catfish with that joker. There he goes. See that cork gone? All we do is pull it in there. Hey, they out there today. Uh oh, we got off. Doggone it. They gonna bite today, folks. When you come in here and you get a bite that quick, they usually, usually catch them. I should have been here earlier. I stopped out on the crappies out there, messed with them a little bit, never caught up with one perch. So we have got a perch. If I wanted some cut bait, I could use that perch as cut bait. There he goes again. See that cart? It tipped down one time. There he goes. He's, he's pulling it down. That might be a brim, not a... A lot of times them brimp, there he goes. That ain't no brimp. That's a catfish. Boy, did he take it. What? Oh, my. That's a good one. Them big ones ain't here today. I mean, them big ones ain't here today. Laser man fishing on the rocks with the old fish. Look at here. Look at here. Look at him. Them good ones. Them good old channels. Look at that. Huh? We're using a rubberized net. Makes it, uh-oh, he went out the bottom. Tad blame hole in the net. I'll tell you what, every net I got got holes in it. I didn't realize this one had a hole in it, but it does. <laughs> it does. Y'all seen him go right through it. Them jokers is eating it today. I mean, they eating it today. We're gonna have to get that poke on him. Get him out. I don't want these jokers. I need long pants on. I don't want a fin in my leg. And I don't want a fin in my in my seat. So I gotta watch my so, This catfish poker works really good with a crappy hook. Look at that. Huh? What? Douche. You gotta love it. Hey. We ain't got to throw for today. I ain't putting them catfish in that live well. I'm putting them in that drum. Okay, I hate I got a, I really need to take some line and fix that hole. It might cause me an anguish here later. But anyhow, hey, you see what we got set up. We got a, actually a number eight hook. <laughs> I like a number four, but I got an eight hook. I can bend it out and make it look like a number four. But uh, the eight hook, uh, now about a number seven split shot, which is a little bit bigger than what I normally use, because them rocks out there, if you use too big, them rocks out there, if it goes down in them rocks, it'll, it'll catch it, and you'll get hung up. We got a few of our Georgia Wigglers, and I got several boxes of night crawlers. But you look at that wiggler. That's from my yard. That joke is as big as a night crawler. That hook ain't big enough for him. But if you get him on the hook, I promise you, that catfish will take him. They love him. That's like an hors d'oeuvre to a catfish. I don't know how long they're gonna bite. I wish now to come straight over here. I spent an hour over there messing around trying to catch a crappie. 
If I'd come straight over here, we'd have a box full by now. Look at that worm. Huh? Actually, that's a lot hanging off. I need to double him back again. He gonna, he gonna pull off. Make a wide. They like a wide. All right, well, we got a wide right there. Throw it back out. I like that heavy cart. It's got a lid on it. You can throw it. Y'all see it out there? So far, I ain't sat there long. I thought I seen fish in there on the fish front, on the live scope, but it wouldn't hit that metal. And then I got a bite on the metal, and somehow or another, I had a double jig rig, somehow or another, it broke off. I didn't even set the hook, and he done broke off. There he goes. Look at that, already gone. If that ain't quick, I'm telling you, they eating it up today, folks. We gonna sit here and catch a drum load of fillets today. Look at him. Look at that. Look at that. Hey, sir, kitty cat. Uh-oh, about to knock the camera down. Kitty cat. Well. Y'all see him? Let's catch another one, what y'all say? This is kind of like finesse fishing for catfish. It ain't big rods and heavy duty line. It's a little line. I don't like that heavy stuff. I'm a, I'm a more of a light rod kind of man. You won't see me fishing with heavy rods often. All right, they might quit when the sun comes out. That's why I say I got here late. But then again, you never know. They might even pick it up. Right now, they're biting pretty darn good. So far, every time we throw one up there, we've caught one. All right, let's chuck it back out, John. The wind's getting up now. But we got a heavy enough cart. We can chunk that baby now, though. I hope they don't quit, because they, they seem to be in there today. I'll be honest with you. There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. Got a nothing. We got a nothing. We got a nothing. Nice one, too. Look at that. Huh? Old channel cats. That's what they are. Look at that. Come in here, boy. Come in here and I knock my camera slam off. Dad, blame you. I knock the camera slam off. Come in here, boy. Come in here. The old fisherman. Where my poke? Hi. Right. Hey, we got a nothing. Nice kitty cat. Look at that. Huh? Nice one. Let's get another one. What y'all say? All right, let's throw it back at you. What a big girl's lie. I There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. Oh my, there he goes. That's a good one. Oh my, that's a good one. Hey, day. That joke is pulling. Come in here, boy. These things are fun to catch. I mean, fun to catch. Look at him. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful kitty cat.
<clears throat> make a good little fillet. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. I hate the winds getting up. That's what I hate. We got another kitty cat. Y'all see him? Look at that. Let's put us another worm on. What y'all say? I love cart fishing now. You know, we done one video here a couple weeks ago with minnows, but this cart fishing, watch that cart go down, it's mighty fun. Lazy man fishing. It's hard to beat that. I like to feel them tap it too when they're hitting that minnow. But uh, I'm thinking worms is the best. Oh, cut bait. Hard to beat worms. The thing about a worm is you got a, uh, you might catch one of them big old slab shell crackers is out there. That goes a bite. One's playing with it right now. There he goes. Got him. It'll come around there, I'll touch that thing, then they'll take off with it. I guess they're eating it. Nothing like it. Nothing like fishing, folks. <sighs> Nothing like fishing. Y'all see it? Look at that. Fine eating right there. Hey, we might feel that drum. We might feel that drum, y'all. <clears throat> Let's throw that little bit of worm out there. I ought to get one. What y'all say? I want to say about this kind of fishing, I got me a piece of carpet down, plus I got a towel on top of the, my, new, my new carpet. I don't want to mess up my new boat. One good thing about this boat's got dark carpet and don't show dirt as bad. We still don't want to mess it up. And fishing like that, you sure mess something up. There he goes. He hit it. Hit it one time. See if he comes back and gets it. There he goes. Hitting again. That might not be a... It is a catfish, too. That joker had to hit it two or three times before he took it. That's a good one, too. That's a big old catfish. <clears throat> That's a nice one. That is a nice one. Oh, yeah. That, there's a netter. That is a netter, folks. Oh my, that's a netter. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Old blue, that's what, them blue's a lot bigger. Look at that, oh my goodness. Hmm, I know one thing, we got to patch this net. Joker's gonna come out of that thing. Look at that. He swallowed it to his guzzle too. He surely did. My rag ain't big enough. I need a bigger rag, y'all. Now oh, another one. I sure don't want that to go stick me. All right. Get that boy, he swallowed it. There he is. Huh? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. In the drum. Look at that. Get 
one little worm at you. I think my worms crawled out last night. They ain't near in there well, like I put them in there. I should have stuck them in the refrigerator. Put them in the refrigerator, they won't crawl out. But if they can get out, they go about the side of that lid, they gone. And I think that's what's happening. But we'll have enough. We'll have enough. <clears throat> Probably gonna fillet these babies in there. They're easier to fillet in their skin, I can tell you that. My old hands got arthritis and it's hard to grip them pliers and skin them like I used to. I used to skin the devil out of them. Can't do it fast no more. If you got an electric fillet knife, that works really well with catfish, but I have one, but I, I think I ain't used it in years. The blades always do so quick. You mess with them late the fillet knife for me. So I just use my Dexter. Dexter's hard to beat. I've tried other brands. I just not fond of the other brand. A lot of other brands, the metal's too thin on the knife during blade bends. I don't want nothing like that. Seven inch Dexter is my favorite. I ain't seeing them now. There he goes, there he goes. Oh, he, they take it, they take it. Hey, they, they take it. They nail it. I mean, they nail it. I mean, big ones. Good one. What? Ain't nothing wrong with him. That's a filet master. Look at that channel cat. Channel cap. Look at here, look at here, look at him. Get in there, boy. Uh, come in here. Old Chanel number five. <laughs> That's what I call a catfish sometimes. I get carried away. Mm. All right. You know you get getting old when you got to grunt every time you lean down. Look at that. Huh? Uh-oh, there comes another boat. That ain't good. Well, so my John boat is gone to a good friend of mine that works at, high, at a mountaintop. He was proud to get it. He uh, fishes a lot down there around the coast, and that's, that boat was a perfect uh, shrimping boat, flounder boat, any kind of boat. Put your little 25, 35 horsepower on there and keep on going. I'm sure he'll enjoy it. I miss it, but I ain't got too old. Miss Deborah passed away. We always went shrimping in it and, and catching white in spots, spot tail bass and flounder and all that stuff. But now, I got nobody to go with me. We used to have a camper. We, she'd drive the boat, that, uh, pull the boat, and I'd pull the camper, and we'd stay down there for a week. Had us ball. I got no desire now because I got nobody. Life ain't the same when you lose your mate. I ain't got too old to replace her. Nobody interested in a 72-year-old man. So basically... I'm hung out to dry. I hate to say it. All I got to look forward to is doing a YouTube video. It's lonely around my house. Life ain't the same. And it never will be. And you got to relive her passing every day. I, it goes through my mind. It's just tough. There goes a bike. Y'all see that cart go down? Huh? It's just tough to deal with. This fishing helps me. That's a big fish there. My goodness. That ain't no baby right there, folks. Look at that drag. We got a little line, too. That's a big fish. That there's a good one. That's the kind you read about in Catfish Magazine.
We got that boat out there. I forgot he was out there. He hears me hollering going on. He'd be up here on top of me. Oh, Lord, that's a good fish right there. That net is a good one. We got to loosen our drag. He going to break that line, but that's a good one. He got that doggone crappy rod stretched out. Y'all see it? Look at that thing churning. Hmm? That is not a baby. I guarantee you that's a blue. Ain't no way that's a channel. It's a big one. That's a good fish right there. Oh, Lord have mercy. Look yonder going. Look at yonder going. Oh, my God. Huh. You got to love it. When you, oh, I thought he got off. They changed it. They moved that head around the other side. It feels like they're getting off. Huh? I don't know how big he is. He ain't no monster, but let me tell you, for a crappy rod, he's a good one. Huh? What? Lord have mercy. He ain't giving up. He's mad. This sucker, he's mad. He is really mad. Huh? He's really mad. I mean, mad. Look at him. I can't hold him, folks. Look at that rod going out of the water. Oh, my goodness. I had a bigger net at the house I might have should have brought. I normally put it in the boat when I'm catfishing these, on these rocks. You never know what you're going to get. You might get a monster. I mean, you might get a monster. Good gosh, folks. I'd like to have me some live shad to throw on these rocks like Richard and them does up there. I bet you I'd catch me some whoppers. <laughs> oh, my God. I ain't got a bait tank to hold them. Of course, I could use a cut shad. That, that's a good fish, see, folks. That ain't no baby. That's probably eight pounds or, or more. He going to fill his net up if we get him. He going to be hard to get up here because I got that cart right there in my rod right now and it's bent over double. Look at that, what a fish. Huh? A worm. Old blue. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That's a good one, ain't it? Huh? That is a monster. That's the kind you read about in Blue Magazine. <clears throat> hey, day. Look at that, what a fish. What? He done wore me out. We might do a catfish video, us too. Yeah. I caught him right in that lip. <clears throat> he done wore me out. <laughs> I'm tired. That fish right there wore me out. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. That's a good one, ain't it? Look at that thing. Right. Oh, my goodness. That is a good one. Man. I wasn't expecting one that big. I probably about seven, eight pounds. Man. Old Blue. How are you, Mr. Blue? How are you, Mr. Blue? I get all this junk off my line now. I don't like all that. I bit at it. There he goes. Oh, I missed him. Doggone it. I missed him. I don't know if he'll come back and take it or not. He might. I don't know. Might have got my worm. There he goes. He gone. He come back after. Dog on it behind the boat though with cameras the other way. So we got to use the chest camera on this one. That's for sure. Hey, they he ain't that big. He's a nice one. He ain't that bad. He ain't that bad. Oh yeah. Come in here, boy. I'm in here. Oh, Chanel number five. Channel cat. Get him around the boat here. On this side. Oh, we dip him. Huh? Y'all see him? Y'all see him? Look at that. Oh, yeah. Y'all see him? Come here, baby. That right there is a perfect fillet size catfish. I mean, perfect. He's even more perfect he didn't take the doggone hook down his throat. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. Whew. I'm getting a barrel full. 
Come back down here, wormy. Come back down here, wormy. I know y'all like me doing different things. Sometimes it's just hard to get off of them crappies when they bite. I know some people look like them crappy videos too, though. So, you know, I do the best I can do. But this week, we've had a brim video. And, uh, and uh, now a catfish video. So you got to love that. Got to love that. Get back up here. See how fast that thing is? Unbelievable. I ain't never had a trolling motor like that. That's just 24 volt, 80 pound truss. Now, there's some of them trolling motors is way kind of stronger than that. I tell you, if you got aluminum bows, you better watch what trolling motor you put on it. Tear the whole nose off that thing. One thing I like about this one is it gradually gets up to the speed. There he goes. Feel that? Huh? They still biting y'all. Good ones too. That's a good one. Oh my goodness. I look back and the carp was gone. Good one. Look at that. Huh? That's another good one. Look at that. Look at that rod. Oh my goodness. Look at that rod. Lord have mercy. Look at that rod. Well, I know what we're going to be doing the rest of the week. We're going to catfish. We're going to catch us a freezer full of catfish for a fish fry. <laughs> Filet catfish. Golly, that's always pulling. Look at him. You think that sucker ain't mean? Them jokers pull, people. I mean, they pull. Hey, they, they pull. Look at here. Look at here. Look at him. Big old channel. Look at that water catfish. My goodness. Are we having fun or what? Look at that. Hey, they, what is that? Four pounds? That's what I'm thinking. Probably four. Hey, they keep biting like that, I'll be happy. You see him? Look at that. Huh? We're getting a tub full of fish. What we getting? A tub full of fish. I know I need to retire, but hey, I'm boneheaded. I know Richard retires all the time. I, I'm bad about not retiring now. You won't see me retire much unless it's something breaks that I retire. I ain't got time for that. <laughs> we got to put fish in the boot. That's what the old fisherman does. He puts fish in the boot. <laughs> Get back up here. Well, I'm making a mess in this boat. I might have to take the hose to it. All right. There he goes. One bumped it. There he goes. He played with it. There he goes. We got him this time. We got him this time. Oh my. Small one. The smallest one of the day. Smallest one of the day. A good eating size though. The smallest one of the day. Y'all see him? See him? Put a fresh worm on it. I tell you, I ain't got no worms in here. Unless they hide. If I was a worm in there, I'd be hiding. I can tell you that much. I, every time I catch a fish, I'm blown out 40 yards. Every time. Back in yonder. What a big girl's life.
There he goes. See that cart going now? I'm going to let him take it. We got him. We want to have him now. Yep. We got him. We got him. Nice one, too. Good one. Good one. Come on in here, boy. Come on in here to the old fish one. That's a good one. I'm working around this side of the boat. Old channel cat. Come back around that boat. Y'all see him? Let's dip him. What y'all say? Look at that. Old blackhead joker. He's a blackhead joker. Huh? He's a blackhead channel. Boy, I tell you what, it didn't take him long to get it. We got him. Look at that. Huh? That's what I'm talking about. Hey, we get we got to put some more water in them in the catfish. Put another bucket of water in the catfish. We can uh, huh? We can uh, we getting a drum full, ain't we? Put more water on. <sighs> hey, we having fun or what? We gonna have some fun. We go to clean the fish this evening. Logo had to sit on a golf cart for a long time. Let's get her back up there. What y'all say? Hey, we're having fun, ain't we? I love catching them. Jokers with a cart. You can't beat that. That old big cart is bip, bip, gone. Normally, in the past, I'd have two carts out. I just don't feel like working it that hard. We're gonna get by with one today. I got another one set up to put out. I just, I don't think it's necessary. There he goes. He's easing off with it. There he goes, we got him. We got him. Oh my, that's a good one too. Oh Lord, that's a big fish. That there is a monster. That is a whopper. He don't even know he's hooked. Lord have mercy. Look down the going. That fish don't even know he's hooked. Look at that, look at that reel. Great day. That's got to be a uh, blue. That's got to be a blue. He's going back into the rocks. Oh my gosh, I ain't never seen one go back to the bank like that. That's where he's going. He's trying to find a place to get around something. Hey, that, we got a monster, folks. We got one like it's on the headline of Catfish Magazine. I mean, a big one. Joe's pulling in. Look at Look at that reel. Oh my God, look at that reel. I got it loose. I'm going to tighten up a little bit. I don't want to break that line, though. That's a big fish. That's the biggest one of the day, I can tell you that. That is a whopper. He keeps wanting to go up to the rocks. He going up the bank. I guarantee you this one's over 10 pounds. Look at that. Lee, I'm going to be here for a while. Oh, my God. I thought he got off. He wiggled. I thought he got off. That joker bit it funny, too. It's like he sucked it down. That ain't but six-pound test, folks. He will, if he gets it down that deep, he will saw it off with his teeth. So I got to be very gentle with him. Ain't no horse in this fish here. We got to be gentle. Look at that joker. Look at that rod. Look at that rod. Oh my goodness, look at that rod. That joke, when I stuck him, I thought I had a rock. Oh Lord. Ain't no rock, he's a big cat. He gonna feel that net. Mm. Man, that joke is pulling. 
That is a good one. Oh my God, I thought he done broke off. He gonna break off yet. I know he's gonna break off. Uh, that is a monster catfish, y'all. Uh, day for worms. Lord have mercy. Come on in here, boy. Come on in here to the old fisherman. Mm. Oh my gosh. Uh. <laughs> Yo. Is that a good one? I'll tell you that right now. I tell you, I've caught them in here with 20 pounds like fishing like this. My biggest one I caught in here is 50 pounds on six pounds as line, but this ain't nowhere close to 50. 50 pounds will take off. But he, he's a good 10, I guarantee you on that. If he ain't, he's gonna surprise me. Oh, I see a cart. I see a cart. Oh, Lord, I thought he done got off. Oh, he gonna go back for another punt run. Mm, I just wanna see him. Hey, day. I just wanna see him. Hey, that's a big one. That is a big one. Okay, day. Mm. He done got me wall slammed out. I can tell you that much. All right, we're getting him back where we see the cork again for about the third time. Okay. It can be hard to get up to the top to dip is the problem. Ease him up. Oh, that's a big fish, y'all. This net ain't gonna be big enough. I ain't lying, that's a big fish. That is a very, that, that's a good, I don't know how much he weighs. He's a big one. He's a big one. I ain't nowhere close to got him either. He is a big one. He is a whopper. Them big ones are coming in probably to spawn. What I said, yes. He's a bigger. We're gonna have to get our catfish holders to hold him. He's gonna tear up everything up here. When I put him on the deck. If I put him on this deck, I don't know if I got a net big enough for him. He's up under the boat, yo. Know? I gotta stand up. Can't get him. Oh my goodness, what a fish. Look at that, like a shark. We got him wore down now though. Yeah, we got him. What a blue, good God, look at that, what a fish. Huh. That is a big one. Folks, Whew. that is a monster right there. I ain't kidding you, that's a I don't know why. See, I got him hooked right at the top. That's why he didn't saw my line. And the hook fell out of his mouth. Huh? The jokers will hurt you. They'll bite the devil out of you. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that water catfish. Huh? What? Put him in the drum. Hey, day. That, that's a load, that's on. What? Only reason I caught that fish is that he didn't swallow enough to chew that line. Only reason. That's a big one. Whew. All right, so we're back up there. Hey, that's some big one there. The more big ones is out there. It probably get them coming in the spawn. He took it so funny, he kind of dipped the cork a little bit. I thought it was a brim. Next thing you know, he gone.
And he went up by them rocks a couple times too, trying to find a place to break off. There he goes, getting another bite. Watch that cart. It's fixing to go down. There he goes. There he goes. Got him. Another big one. No, he ain't quite as big as that one. <laughs> but he's a nice one. Hey, we're having fun, ain't we? Hey, we're having fun today. Catfish are coming in. I said, that's a darn big one. There ain't no little one. He ain't big as that one, but he's a, he's a nice one. Look at him. That's a good one. Swimming around. Look at here. Look at him. There he goes. Hey, gosh. Look at that line. Look at that line take off. He just figured out he was hooked. Might be another big one. Hey, he day. That might be another big one, y'all. I believe it is. That fish didn't even know he was hooked when he's up under the boat. Look yonder. Oh my goodness. Whew. I'm tired. It's wearing me out. My old shoulders is aching. I mean, my old shoulders are aching. Look yonder going. If you don't think they like to come along the earthworm, they call them Georgia Wigglers. I don't know what kind of worm they are. But I can tell you this. They free. And you cannot beat free worms. And they like them better than they do them other ones. Look at that. Ain't no baby right there, folks. That is about an eight pounder. Look at that. Old blue. Blues are coming in, folks. Come in here, boy. The blues are coming in. What? Look at there, look at there. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. What? Where's my poker? Where's my catfish poker? Now he swallowed it. You got to give it to that dog on six pound as floral carbon. That's some tough stuff. Mm hmm, look at that. Ain't nothing wrong with that one either, is it? In the barrel. Got it going on today, folks. Ever so often we get lucky and get it really get into some fish. We in the fish right now. They bite the same like they're starting to bite better again. The big ones. We went from shallows to blues. Is what we done. Alright. Hey, day sliming up my line. I'll be cleaning fish all evening this evening. Me and old Logan boy. Old Logan the Schnauzer. You got to love a Schnauzer. And that joker, he's smart as a whip. Loves his daddy. He knows my routine. He knows when I'm going fishing, he lays on that couch. He knows I'll be back when I get back. And he's so happy to see me when I open the door, he's straight out there sets in that golf cart that I come out there. Where he's at? Sets out there. Right out there. I might get him. Oh yeah, there's some. See him? See him right there? There's a whole pile of fish right in there where I just threw. That cork ought to go. I don't want to get too close. There he goes, what I tell you. I seen him in there. I seen a member. Nice one too. Another big one. I believe. And a nice one. I seen a member. Whole school of them. It was three or four of them. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Come in here, channel. Come in here, channel. Come in here, channel. Come in here, channel. Look at here, look at here, look at here. Oh my, look at him. He's, hey, you got him in the lip. Best place to get him. Y'all see him? Look at that. Hey, we're getting a drum full. Tell you that much. We're getting a good drum full. All right, let's put us a fresh arm on there. Mm, ain't got many. 
if I'd have used them all. We're gonna try it with one worm this time. See if one worm will do it. Dog on winds uncaught me, took me down to nowhere land. Get back around. Throw it back out. Right back. There he goes. That cork gone. Look at it. Oh, come back up with it. That might not be a catfish. Yes, it is, too. He took it that time. He took it that time. My goodness, he took it that time. Huh? Look at him. What? We're catching them, ain't we, folks? we catching them today. They're biting today. I can tell you that right now. They're biting today. Swallowed it. Gotta get the poker. We gotta wrap him up and get the poker. What we gotta do. Ow. That poker is remarkable. Y'all see it? Really and truly, I ought to have long pants on doing this. Kind of dangerous doing it with short pants on. I need a bigger towel too. I got my big towel getting all the dirt and stuff on the bottom. I need a, another big towel for wrapping them suckers up. Had to hunt me another towel tonight. Now I ain't seeing nothing on live scope. When I see him on live scope, throw it out there. It's gone. Right there's one. He's right under the boat. Though. There he goes. One just hit the cart. Hit it one time. There he goes. See? Gone. He gets a taste of it, and then he comes back to get it. What'd he do? Look at him. Big one. That's another big one. That's another big one. I can tell you that. That's another big one. Great day. <laughs> he done gone down. He done gone under the boat. I chined. What? Another big one. Hey, day they biting the day. <laughs> they biting the day, folks. We gonna have us a bucket full of catfish fillets today. Look at that. That sucker's pulling. He's pulling. I can tell you that much. He ain't as big as that biggest one, but he's a nice one. He's another, another nice one. You got to remember, I ain't, re, ain't retired yet, so I don't know how good this line is. When I hit that trolling motor, he said, he felt that. He gone again. He heard it. That's a good one. What? That is a good one right there, son. I am not lying to you. That's a six pounder or more. Probably more. Ready day. What? What, 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 what? Hey, Jake. Look at that. Look at that, what a catfish. Come in here, boy. Get in that net. Oh, Lord, get in that net. We got him. It took a while, but we got him. Great. That's a heavy catfish right there. Blue. Blue cats. Oh, blue cat. Look at that. Huh? What? What? Mm. I'm gonna lay him down on his towel.
We got him. We got him. Look at that. Look at that. Old fisherman. Look at that. We in a tub, boo. Crazy. Dang, we in a tub, fool. We having a good time, ain't we, folks? Ain't nothing like it. It's nothing like fishing. It's a sport, like Richard says. It's second to none because there's so many different types of fishing you can do. And everything's got its own little way of doing it. Everything You can't just go fishing and fish the same for every fish. You've got to adapt and fish the way they want it. So it's all about categories of what type of fish you using, are fishing for and what kind of baits you're using, or how to present it. And that's what I do is I teach people my methods by taking them with me on my videos, on my fishing trips. I've been fishing all my life, and, I've, and, and I, I'm still learning every fishing trip. You don't never stop learning. You just keep comprehending all this stuff and figuring it out and putting it in that book of memories, a fishing book. And then later down, you start leafing through the pages when something don't work and make something work. I started with crappies this morning. I seen a few crappies, didn't bite, caught one perch, and I decided I'm going catfishing. I looked over here, wasn't nobody on this wall, and I, I was prepared. I brought worms. I even got crickets, a few crickets left from the brim fishing. I haven't tried them on here, but I was going to try the crickets on this wall here and see if we can catch some of these brim shallower, because it's, it's brim all up and down these rocks. But they shallower. There goes another bite. They catfish it right outside. You see that? Can't beat it, folks. They eating it up today. This is like old times today. Oh, he come loose. That's a lucky catfish right there. He come loose. Just pull loose. I had him, too. I pretty well had him. But he's pretty well gone right now at this point. <clears throat> Took my nice little worm. That's what he done. Hey, worms are expensive. When you can dig them out the yard, that's a plus. What do they think about charging five dollars, four dollars, and something a box for worms? Ain't nothing. Then you got to pay the darn sales tax. Sales tax right here is six, seven percent, six or seven. It depends on where you buy them. In some of the places, you got several different taxes that you hit you with. End up being ten percent. So it just don't seem fair. Every way you turn around, somebody's stealing your money. The government county stealing your money all right but hey I shouldn't complain I've been fortunate I'm not broke but I'm not rich I'm rich my reason of being rich is because I'm enjoying what I do that's the rich it ain't about how much money you got it's about how how you get along with the simple and then have a good time. We had a bite right there. There he goes, catfish. Got him. Boy, they out there thick as hell on the dogs back today, folks. It's just unbelievable. They out there like old times today. There's no doubt about it. My son Adam loves this. Deborah used to love it too. Deborah wouldn't have passed away, she'd have probably been fishing with me. She'd probably be retired now. She was getting ready to quit. Her mama passed away as she did. She was gonna take care of mama and retire, but it didn't work like that. <laughs> it did not work like that. All right. I had to go buy me some more needle nose pliers. That darn towel, the last time I was fishing, I went to dump the towel out and didn't realize I had my pliers in it. And guess what? Out the lake. I done done that twice with that towel. That towel, you got to watch it, make sure it's clean of all, all your pliers and stuff before you go to whip it out and knock the dirt out of it in the lake. I whipped it and slapped it in the air and they went my pliers. So, you know, it's not smart to do what i done there. Yeah, I just spent 20 more dollars and got some more pliers. What I done. 
That ain't much worm, but I'm telling you, the way they biting out there today, I believe it's enough. We're going to have to get to the night crawls in a minute if we keep on. Well, we got a drum half full. That drum gets full. I definitely got to go home. I ain't want no more than that. There's a limit on blue cats. I think it's 30. I ain't sure. I need to know that. But I ain't. Most of mine, I ain't got that many blues. Most of the cats I got there now are channel cats. And there's no limit on channel cats in this lake. I think it's 30. I, I need to find out. I generally don't keep that many blues. There he goes. He done hit it right there. The gun are going. Look at it. So, them jokers are out there, buddy. They biting today. The it's unbelievable how they biting today. The That's a good one, too. And I think it's starting to. Oh, I thought he got off. I think it's starting to bite better. Well, I think up in the day, I have seen that. Hey, day. That joke's pulling. Huh? That joke is pulling. We done hit the mother load in here with catfish. I can tell you that. We done hit the mother load. A mother load of catfish is what we done hit. That's probably gonna be the title. Look at him. I'm a big old channel cat. Come in here, boy. No, that might be a blue. Come in here. No, it's I ain't sure. That blame it. I think it's a channel. Whew. Lord have mercy, they wearing me out. They wearing me out. Oh, hey, day he done come out the net. Out of his mouth, through his whiskers. Look at that. Had him by the, the edge of his whisker. Oh, look at that. Beauty. Lord have mercy. This is some old boy.